Join History Victorum as we visit the Temple of Juno in Agrigento, Sicily. This temple shows fire damage from the Carthaginian conquest of the city. It is located on the highest rocky peak of the temple area, and it was restored by the Romans. There is nothing to indicate that the temple was actually dedicated to Juno. It is believed that there was confusion between this temple and another temple, which was mentioned by Roman writer Pliny the Elder in Naturalis Historia. It was built between 460 and 440 BC from local limestones. It was built in the Doric style with four steps leading up to the foundation. The columns are made of four drums, which are the sections stacked on top of each other, with fluted shafts which run vertically on the columns. There were six columns on the short side and 13 columns on the longer side. In 406 BC, during the Carthaginian conquest, known as the Siege of Acragas, the temple was heavily damaged by fire. You may notice reddened stone blocks, which are considered evidence of this damage. The temple was later restored during the Roman period. In the late Roman period, it is believed to have been abandoned during the persecution of pagans. Unlike the Temple of Concordia, it was not converted to a Christian church. Between the 6th and 7th century, an earthquake struck which resulted in partial collapse of the structures. These structures were later restored in the second half of the 18th century, with some columns being re-erected. 13 of the 36 columns still exist, along with a portion of the original entablature, which is the portion sitting on the columns of the shorter side. On the eastern side, you can see the 10 steps that led up to the altar. Thank you for joining History Victorum. Let us know in the comments if you were able to find the red stones that were burned by the Carthaginians. And don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.